the question is a body of mass 5 kg is moving with a momentum of 10 kg meter per second a force of 0.2 newton acts on it in the direction of motion of the body for 10 seconds the increase in its kinetic energy is a 2.8 joule b 3.2 joule c 3.8 joule d 4.4 joule so we have to find change in kinetic energy is change in kinetic energy is equal to final kinetic energy minus initial kinetic energy means to calculate change in kinetic energy we will subtract initial kinetic energy from final kinetic energy so first of all we will find initial and final kinetic energies so we can calculate kinetic energy in terms of momentum by using the formula is initial kinetic energy is equal to p square upon 2 into m here p is given as 10 so the square of 10 divided by 2 into m means mass is given as 5 so the square of 10 is 100 divided by 10 so so this zero will be get cancelled with this zero so initial kinetic energy is obtained as 10 joules now we will find final kinetic energy which is equal to p square upon 2m is final linear momentum is not obtained so first of all we will calculate final linear momentum as we know that impulse is equal to force into time so force is 0.2 newtons and time is 10 seconds so impulse will be obtained as 2 newton into second as force is 0.2 newton and time is 10 seconds so impulse is obtained as 2 newton into second as we know that impulse impulse is equal to change in linear momentum which is equal to final linear momentum minus initial linear momentum so we have calculated impulse as 2 so by putting 2 in place of change in linear momentum because change in linear momentum is equal to impulse so 2 is equal to final linear momentum minus initial linear momentum is given which is 10 so by putting 10 so final linear momentum will be equal to final linear momentum will be equal to plus 10 plus 2 so final linear momentum will be 12 kg into meter per second now we will calculate final kinetic energy so final kinetic energy will be equal to final linear square of final linear momentum divided by 2 into m so the square of 12 upon 2 into m is given which is 5 kg so the square of 12 is 144 divided by 2 into 5 it will be 10 so final kinetic energy will be obtained as 14.4 joule finally we will find change in kinetic energy so change in ke is equal to final kinetic energy minus initial kinetic energy is change in kinetic energy is equal to final kinetic energy is obtained as 14.4 and initial kinetic energy is obtained as 10 joules so 14.4 minus 10 so 14.4 minus 10 so change in kinetic energy is obtained as 4.4 joules which is our required answer so the correct option will be d 4.4 joule